Hey, good morning everybody. It's Mama K on Shay's Way and we're looking at Blade right now. He's hungry. We're gonna feed him in just a minute. It's early. I'm gonna say good morning to Jazz. So we are recording today on the Apple 11 Pro. Shayna's sleeping, so I'm borrowing her camera and I'm gonna do an Amazon fresh unbagging. any of you ever shopped on Amazon Fresh? I have some health challenges. I am so grateful for this service. This is Amazon Fresh and we're gonna see if it's fresh today. Sometimes you can get a good order and most of the times I do but if you get a bad item you can request a refund. You do have to go to the chat or the email and let them know what happened. So here we go. They come in bags, and even the frozen stuff comes in these bags so that everything is recyclable. And they have a side to keep your items cold. This bubble wrap cooler. And look what they do. They actually package, instead of using ice, they package items with frozen water bottles. So you actually get free water with your order if you are ordering perishable items that need to be refrigerated and i will pull out so this is all free water they don't charge you for the water but i'm sure because of their membership fee which is about six over a little over 16 dollars a month this is nothing to amazon so they can offer that so today we got Shayna some Kite Hill cream cheese. She wants to try a vegan cream cheese and she has not yet tried this brand. We did get this brand last month, opened it, tried it in a recipe that needed cooking, but she never got to try it on her bagel and it molded. Caution with this product, it seems very perishable. And so we will not open it until she's ready to use that. Next we got an orange juice. Shayna loves orange juice in the morning and she doesn't drink a whole lot so I just got a small. And I like this harmless coconut water. This is the best tasting coconut water I found next to a real Thai coconut. They use young Thai coconuts. It's organic. It does turn pink which is odd because typically this is clear in the coconut but I'm I have a feeling that when in the process of opening and bottling it maybe oxidizes a little bit and gets that there it's pinkest pinkish color so there you have it that's what is in bag one and i'm gonna put these in the fridge there is the water in the fridge waiting for shana for when she's ready bag number two This was a heavy bag because we've got a small watermelon, some mangoes, and some sweet potatoes, and oranges. Now we will put the mangoes in this bowl. We got some of these avocados need to go in the fridge. Hmm, this is strange. I never ordered a green pepper and Shane doesn't eat them and I can't eat them with my stomach issues. I'll have to see if I got charged for this, but this was not part of my order. I'll just leave that here as a reminder. Look at this cute little watermelon. This will make a nice breakfast. I usually eat half of one of these. Um, for breakfast and then the other half the next day. I am a raw food vegan, so I do eat a lot of fruits and vegetables. Yummy. So I only got three oranges for eating. The rest I'm gonna juice. And 
these I'm gonna make for the dogs, believe it or not. They love sweet potatoes. And I did go ahead and feed them. So they're having their breakfast and Topic is still up in Shana's room. So we will feed her. Hi Jess, no we're not looking at you. So we will feed her when she comes down. And she likes to sleep in with her mama. I don't remember ordering any avocados. So unless they were mistakenly put in the bag, I will have to sort that one out. But again, sometimes Amazon does make a mistake and they are very good at correcting it. You just have to contact them and they will make all the adjustments if there has been any miscalculations or bad patterns or ruined items. So that's what I really like about Amazon Fresh. It is a little bit of a hassle, but they are good about customer care. Okay. In the next bag, we have a pineapple, bananas, and tangerines. It is finally tangerine season, although a lot of people get them all year round. I prefer to get them during their season and when they are at their freshest. We are going to freeze some of those bananas for smoothies. And my all-time favorite fruits are pineapple and watermelon can't get enough of those. It is hard to get a good watermelon. You are relying on the person choosing your, I'm not right, watermelon. The watermelons have been good this year, but in previous years, they're eh. But the pineapples is hit or miss. Um, depending on the person choosing your pineapple, you never know if it's gonna be good or bad. But these halos look gorgeous. I love to get mostly organic, but it is hard to find fresh organic produce when you're relying on an online service, although Amazon does use Whole Foods and they have a great selection. They just don't have everything at all times. So our fourth bag is another refrigerated or cold bag. So we'll see what is in there. So I eat mostly raw fruits and veggies and anything else is going to be Shana's. I don't touch any products that have been commercially made and man-made. And look at this caution, this is dry ice. Do not touch this, it will burn your fingers. So be very careful of that and maybe place it in another bag so that you do not touch that. Okay, so in this bag, it is Shana's bag, of course. She has some frozen corn, and she likes me to put that in certain dishes. So this bag does not have any free water because it is a highly frozen, perishable bag, and they pack it with dry ice, which is very lightweight. Shana's favorite new treat is this non-dairy Ben & Jerry's coffee caramel fudge non-dairy frozen dessert. She has been having allergies to dairy. Right now she is eating this non-dairy stuff as a treat. She said it is a very good replacement. So any of you who cannot tolerate dairy, give it a try. You may like it. Oh, yum. Okay, this is a special treat. I don't very often eat cooked foods. However, oh boy, the artichokes look amazing and i think i will leave them in the bag okay unfortunately amazon did pack heavy artichokes on my organic grapes i'm gonna probably cook these right away today because these for me these are a huge treat and for shana we love artichokes and um, we enjoy eating them together as a treat so let's see how these held up they look good they, they didn't get badly affected nothing is squashed if it was i would contact them and ask for a refund and they are very good about giving those so i am not mad about this at all had they been squashed that would be a different story because it is frustrating when you do have to sit down and go through your order and contact them on chat because they don't let you get refunds directly from just you know choosing the items that was damaged you do have to kind of go on a chat or send an email. And I usually just do the chat because it's a lot faster. 
And they're very helpful and they're quick to refund anything damaged. Last bag is some beauty products that Sheena has been requesting. These are for burpees. They have apparently have been pretty helpful with her. With when she gets acne, she doesn't get a lot of acne. And then I decided I wanted to try some of their shampoo. I was using another brand. Like the natural shampoos are hit or miss. So I wasn't finding it working well for my hair. But uh, so I did get these Burt Bees shampoo and conditioner. This is new for me. It says very volumizing. I have very flat thin hair. And I wanted to give it a try. Uh, that just looked appealing. Uh, packaging is a big plus for me and the packaging looks nice and I haven't, haven't tried this, but Burt Bees is a good brand and it's a natural brand and I use all natural products. I got their very volumizing shampoo with pomegranate and their more moisture conditioner with, what is that? Ba Baobab? Wood? Baobab? Okay, well, I have no clue what a Baobab is, so I am gonna be looking that ingredient up. I guess it is this plant. Good Lord, it looks almost like a chocolate plant like a cacao plant. Who knows? Oh, well, maybe it is. Okay, and I'll be reading the ingredients later just to make sure because I do have some allergies. Shanna really likes her acne solution, so we got her that. And then a lipstick. It's like a chapstick, only it has pigment in it, and this is the watermelon lip shimmer. Don't know how that shade will look but it looked pretty online and she likes to use these products and she has been asking for the burt bees facial cleansing towelettes this is the pink grapefruit sea normal to oily skin she doesn't have oily skin i heard that these kind of cleansing towelettes can be drying but Shayna wants to give it a try. I did try their cucumber towelettes and I really, really like them, but I don't think Shayna would. They're a little astringent. I might steal a pink grapefruit one from her just to see how it feels. And the last product is the Acne Solutions. What is this? Oh, it's a pore refining scrub. So that is something for probably not every single day, but a good exfoliating scrub. We're gonna give these products a try. That is it for my Amazon Fresh unbagging today. Thanks for being here. Check out Amazon Fresh. It actually saves a lot of time. It is a little on the pricier side. I just lie in bed at night before I go to bed. I click the app do a little bit of shopping, doesn't take very long, get items I need. They deliver it at the time that you request. You can have someone in person deliver where they'll ring your doorbell and give you your products. I do the doorstep delivery, so they just drop them off at my doorstep. I usually choose the earliest morning so everything is super fresh. I have ordered things at night and have had no problems at all. I think you guys would love it. I think it's a great service. I highly recommend it. I'm so glad they finally are shipping back in my area. They they did discontinue this where I was living for a short time and I had to use the Instacart app of which I also love. So try Instacart and Amazon Fresh. Whatever Instacart doesn't have, Amazon Fresh usually does. Hope this was an interesting video for you guys. And thank you for visiting the Mama K playlist. Thank you everybody for tuning in. This has been an unbagging with Mama K on Shay's way. If you like the videos, please subscribe and hit the post notifications bell. Shayna says to smash it, do whatever, but hit it so that you can get notified when we post new content. And we hope you're loving our stuff. Shayna does have some great merchandise with uh, t-shirts and her logo and Rocket's logo. So please check that out below. Share a comment and let us know what you might want to see because we will include it maybe in the next video. All right. Have a great day. Bye.